If you could just give me a roll call of all your nicknames. A roll call of all my nicknames. Uh, throughout my life, uh, Tilt was my first. Then as I got older, I adopted the, the nickname Lil Badass Tilt. Red, they used to call me in the streets for a minute. And then as I got older in high school, they started calling me Shouty Red. Uh, and now, latest to date, T.I. Uh, okay. Sometimes the names we're born with don't stick. They lack magic, pizzazz, okay. or maybe it's our personalities that run away from them. Clifford Joseph Harris Jr. reeks of accountant, not destined hip hop superstar. And not that there's anything wrong with being an accountant. This just isn't that story. Welcome to the world of a businessman, a father, a rapper, a friend, all battling one another. This is the two sides of hip hop's king, T.I. versus Tip. You just call me. All right. To get to a place of conflict always starts with a dramatic incident, something life-changing. That's how all great movies start. And that's where our story begins. In the early hours of May 4, 2006, T.I. and his entourage were caught in an altercation outside Cincinnati's Club Ritz. Gunshots fired. Close friend and partner Phil Johnson was killed. After then, I didn't really want to, you know, I didn't really want to do no music or nothing no more. Um, I would more focus on construction, professional, you know, corporate business and whatnot. A fashion line, movies, I just really want to focus on, you know, on rap. So rap he didn't, but business he did. As Tip, the street hustling lyricist, grew up into T.I., a right legitimate businessman building an empire of commerce with grand hustle at its core. The young entrepreneur is just as comfortable in the office as the streets, dictating on the phone. Yeah, we'll find a way to make it happen, Matt. If I get a phone call, say there's a problem with the fashion line, then the next few hours of my day will be dedicated to that. Whereas if there's a problem in the film industry, we need help over there, then that'll be the next few hours of my day dedicated to that. I step in when I need to step in and do what I need to do. I well, uh, nah, I'm not near a computer as we speak. I'm not Constantly on the move, T.I. rarely stays in the same place for an extended period of time, always managing several endeavors. Nothing worth having comes without hard work and sacrifice. You're gonna have to struggle, you're gonna have to show how much you want it, show what it's worth to you, you know? And there have been times where it's made it difficult for me, but there's also been times where it's made it easier for me. This, my good man, is elite. Hip hop loves its cars, and T.I. is no exception. Uh, I figure, you know, why not change cars as we change locations? It just works better. I like it better this way. <laughs> Except in this case, the young mogul doesn't just own them, he sells them. Elite Auto Concierge is TI's premium dealership that Tip loves to show off. Would you like to step inside? You know what I'm saying? We can show you some of the things that we have on in, in inventory. This is the six fold from the what you know about that video. It need to be, it need a little TLC. I ain't did much to it since I brought it here. Ain't nothing like dropping your top hand switches on Chrome, man, in the 6.4. Nothing like it. 1969 Chevrolet Camaro Rally Sport drop top. Red cocaine white interior. There's uh, not many Maybox with partitions in the world. You know what I'm saying? I think the only two, the only three I've seen is mine, Kevin Lyles's, and Jay-Z's. The only three I've seen. I kick back in there, man, do everything, man. Watch movies, uh, take meetings, uh, you know, everything. Yeah, I ain't never been the type of person to knock on nobody door with my hand out asking for nothing. And it's as simple as this, man. This is what I'm about to do. You want in? Okay, cool. If not, I'll holler at you later. Hey, who's gonna go get some bird at, man? Hey, how you doing? This is Tip. Uh, how long y'all gonna be open? 
Oh, okay, cool. I'll be bad up. It's in the day-to-day -day tasks you almost forget celebrities do, like pumping gas or eating, that you see glimpses of tip coming through. Good food. Come to, come to the A. Holla at us. It's this personable side that still relates to the streets, and more importantly, the people and places of his home, Atlanta. So out of all the things you're involved in, what makes you the happiest? Take it easy now, Um, I have to say create opportunities for the people around me. T.I.'s construction business is a perfect equilibrium between his professional and personal side. On one hand, he employs his family. This is our latest construction, new finished construction. We are uh, we are building, me and my uncle right here, this is my partner in new finished construction. My other uncle right here. We built this house ourselves, uh, self-funded, self-owned, self-operated. And on the other, this 12-bedroom mansion that sits on the outskirts of Atlanta is a highly profitable entity. Hopefully we can get contracts to build things such as grocery stores or BPs or, uh, excuse me, not BPs, gas station, any gas station, not just BP, gas station. So do you have a message for the Trumps of the world? Do I have a message for the Trumps of the world? Let me in, please. <laughs> please. I can make you money. As one side of T.I. pulls him one way, Tip pulls the other way. And maybe this balance is the reason the king has had the success he has. It's very difficult being a, 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 a viable face on this television screen. It takes away from your reality, from your real life. It doesn't allow you to do the things that you may enjoy, the simple things in life. It don't give you that ability, you lose, you lose that, you know, sometimes when you, when you, when you become a celebrity or, or a certain, uh, reach a certain level of stardom. And, you know, I think that provides that conflict you were talking about. Without T.I., there is no tip. And without tip, there is no T.I. The two sides in constant struggle and constant harmony.